There we go. Okay, it's an optimized for play on the Steam Deck. Which, let me tell you, as streamers, Steam Deck, Stream Deck, naming anything a deck or stream or Steam is going to throw us every single time. Every time. Okay, so. Let's take a look at options. Uh, subtitles, yes. Master volume, eh, a little down. Enable rumble. Battery saver is nice, because if you're on the deck, then it probably is a little less on that. Uh, use native resolution. Apply. Back. Okay, hopefully you can see everything I'm doing. Let me know if, as I'm moving through the game, you're hearing it but not seeing it change. I also really, I don't know, I'm... As a Gen X queer person, I tend to love mid-century modern. I don't believe that a fascination exists. I don't believe like there's this like, okay, so, you know, the style and art of 20 to 30 years before you were born is what you then love for the rest of your life. Because I know nobody, nobody is out there trying to replicate like the 80s and 90s. Welcome to the Aperture Science Competence Center for our most gifted employees. I'm Cave Johnson, and if you're hearing this, you are exceptional. No, don't be bashful. It's true. No false modesty. Let's get started. Look at all those tubes stretching off in the distance. Every one of them's hey, taking Eddie. something important to a genius who's going to use it to change the world forever. A genius just like you. How are you going to change the world? Well, that's up to you. History will remember what you do here today. Do not let us, and by us, I mean all of us, all of humanity, Ooh. down. No pressure. So congratulations. Who's a big You are chicken? about to take part in the greatest science adventure at the greatest applied sciences company on Earth. This That's... is important work. Oh. And you are just the genius to do it. Are we working in the sub, God sub, sub basement? Gifts. I'm giving you the opportunity to use them. Recycled props. Well, here's your lab. I don't mind telling you, we're excited up here. Moon landing excited. Newton, Einstein. Wait Ooh. a minute. That's, now you. that's not right. I think I put the wrong tape in. Hold on. Good luck. World's best science. Okay, here we go. You, in the overalls. Get to work or you're fired. <laughs> they don't give out overalls anymore. Anyway, my name's Grady. You can call me that. I mean... Let's do introductions later. You should really already be... <sighs> Honestly, I'm surprised you're not fired already. <laughs> anyway, uh, you are a uh, ba -ba -ba product inspector. That is your inspection desk there in front of you. You will be inspecting... Uh, okay, uh, doesn't say. Anyway, something is going to come down the conveyor belt, whatever it is. Make sure it works. Once you've done that, keep doing that. That's the whole job. Anyway, just remember, the important thing is to have fun on your own time before you come in. <laughs> Otherwise, it's just, I don't know, it's, it's real bad here. <sighs> it's fine. You'll probably be fine. Good luck. Okay, first off, I'm going to bring the volume back up because it is not heinous. Okay, I really like what they're doing already with... Sorry, um, Switch games do this as well. Like they'll show you a thing and what you're using looks very much like the device. So you've got your buttons over here and you've got like your D-pad over there. Um, so that's very clever. And this is also, oh, you can see them. Oh, you can actually. Okay, so it's having us test things, so, okay, so. <laughs> I don't even know what the L1s and 4s and 5s are for. Okay, this looks like a toilet. We're holding the button down. It's doing a little dance with the water. Flush. 
pass. Okay. When is it going to... Okay. I appreciate... I, I appreciate the... The, like, butt strength there. Okay, so this... Seems very simple. This is every job you ever got that said, no, push this button, push that button, push this button, and then push that button. So you do have to hold. Damn damn it. I knew it. I left the volume down. Hold yeah, on. Zip zap zap. That is how you inspect the toilet. I hope you were paying attention because I'm not saying any of that twice. Look, it's not rocket science. It's not even toilet science. Here's everything you need to know. See that light on the wall? If that light goes on, you're fired. <sighs> okay, good. You heard the important part. Wait, what? Hold on. Have they all been smoking? You know what? It's not our job to test if the toilet's on fire, right? Just do your regular thing like normal. Move it down the line, and then it's somebody else's problem. Um, you think your job's bad? I mean... Can um, you hear that? It's, Hold on, I'll uh, let me take a look. Uh, yeah, keep testing. Oh. <laughs> Can you get me out of here, please? Um, Thank you. I don't... Nope, I'm just wet now. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's just pushing me deeper in. Is it now? It's working. <laughs> oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. Just test it. Get it out of here. I, I can't. No. <laughs> 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 So, first off, I I think we're in a lot of trouble here. Now, I also think we're going to be rich because I think you just admitted something. Okay, here's what we are going to do. I'm going to go work on this in secret. Just you go back and pretend to go back to work, right? Like it's got to look good. I mean, just pretend the most you've ever. You know what? Just go back to work, actually. Yeah, that works. I'll be back. Um, uh, okay. Um. <laughs> oh no, the grasshoppers are learning science. Six months later. We're still testing toilets. We have tested 278,100 toilets. I don't know if that includes the live ammo toilet. I'm back. Uh, first off, you did awesome pretending to calibrate all those toilets. The best. All right, are you ready for this? Presenting. Press, you gotta press the button, presenting, pre presenting <gasps> the Aperture Science Turret. Go on, take it for a spin. Oh. Yeah. And I haven't even shown you the best part. Here's the best part. Shooting. You know what though? I mean, you're definitely gonna kill yourself with it pointing at you like that. So let me just turn it around. All right, shoot again. Don't worry, it's safe. I mean, this time. This time it's safe. Last time it wasn't. You almost died. Wow! Holy moly, man! That just, is great! We just broke it! The prototype! Oh, we man! The turret broke! That was the only one, too. But don't even worry about it, because here's what I've actually been working on. Ta-da! Introducing the Mark II. What? This is what I spent most of the six months on. It was one month for the first turret, and then like five for this bad boy. Oh man, you gotta take my picture with this. Uh, the desk should have a camera built into it. 
Okay, we don't have that button on our... <clears throat> Are you taking a picture? Shut up. We don't have that button on our computer, so we're just going to do this. I'm posing for it right now. This is my posing for... Okay, good. Oh. Moment recorded. Funny. For all the history books. Now for the fun part. You are going to take it for a spin. Here, let me turn it around. Okay, normally I'd walk you through everything, but I think you get it. Let's just open everything at once and see what happens. Um. Okay, go crazy. I can All see those controls do something. on the screen, MK2 oh, also, turret XL. Some of the crates you're shooting at might explode. Don't worry about that. Okay, so... Seriously, go on. You're not going to break it. I mean, I hope you don't break it. Wow, right? Oops. Oh, this is great. This thing shoots so good. Okay, a part fell off. Keep going, though. <laughs> All right, something else fell off. You can still shoot everything else. Don't even worry about it. Okay, quite a bit is falling off. Keep shooting. You're not doing this. This is a structural engineering problem. It's on me. You're doing great. I bet it's the glue. I'm 99% convinced of that now. It even looked cheap when I bought it. I remember looking at it like, ah, spend the extra dollar, and yep, here we are. Oh, that's, um, um... Yeah, no, this is probably fine. Wow, all right, that, so some of the stuff I put on there just didn't work. Most of it, like 90%, uh, or even higher maybe, but some of it worked great. So all we have to do is keep the great stuff and then we, then we can, so, okay, that's the police. Gotta go. So one of us needs to streamline this turret, right? And one of us needs to take the fall for shooting up the warehouse. Because they're, this is a lot of damage and they're gonna look into this. Which job, which job do you want? How about I fix a turret and then you take, yeah, I'll do that part. Remember, if anyone asks, you don't know me, okay? Don't say anything. This is adorable. The grasshoppers are creating their own society. Sorry, the mantises are creating their own society. How many? Oh, wait, we're still working in jail. We also have one of our toilets. Hey, well, I mean, wow, you are the best. Thanks for keeping your mouth shut and doing your time. I mean, 18 it was months way more later time than either of us were expecting. I don't know what was in those boxes we blew up, but they were wow. Were they mad? Anyway, I promise you're not going to regret this. Now let's get you out of here. Given that the offender has faithfully observed the rules of the institution, offender has been granted supervised early release. Please sign for your possessions. Inmates' possessions are as follows: desk. We counted One. the desk as a possession. The inmate must state their name, print their name, then sign their name. After the tone, state your name into the desk. You're not. Oh, you are. Urban Bohemian. Inmate's name is now preserved for the permanent record as. You're not. Oh, you are. Urban Bohemian. <laughs> oh my god it's idiocracy it's idiocracy i love it type your name into the desk moving on now sign Oh, I hate doing this all the time. As a 
condition of supervised early release, parolee and desk agree to report within 15 minutes. And desk. And desk. Hey, don't listen to her. You don't need to worry about reporting to your parole officer. Guess who spent the last 18 months getting his probation agent license through the mail? Oh, no. Yeah, me. That's um, right. Oh, no. I'm your parole officer. Greg. I mean, not just you. I'm managing like seven guys on parole right now, but they're basically reintegrated back into society. Well, not Tony. He's struggling a little, but anyway, that's all I was doing. I got something to show you. Let's get out of here. It is never hey, too word late girl. to met. You are both free to go. Me and my desk. Oh, uh, bring your desk. Am I, do we just... Okay. I streamlined the turret while you were gone. Introducing the Mark III. Look in the background. We got record, record player, so got toaster, lava lamp. And just kept the stuff that worked. I mean, it was totally over engineered. So it just does one thing now. It shoots. <gasps> oh my gosh. <sighs> Our desk like has this. like that the, dumb. Here, the hash marks from how long we've been they in were there. just lying around in the housewares research department in, in a locked room. Oh, the toaster is toast. Ooh, food processor. Okay. Um. It's just like the Mark One. Left trigger opens the wings. Right stick to end. I like that tattoo on your neck. Did you do it yourself? It's like a, is it a dragon holding a knife? It's nice. The more I look at the tattoo, the more I'm thinking we should both have it. Because then we'd be tattoo bros. Anybody would look at us and know we are friends. I think you give me the same tattoo. Would that be weird? It would be weird having the same exact one. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll think of one. What about like a robot arm coming out of the side of my head and it's holding a wrench? So you got a dragon and the knife, and mine's similar, but more robot themed. <laughs> Man, that'd be so cool. Oh, speaking of being cool, I've got something even this better so to show good. you. Gyroscopic controls. I don't it's know if I can easy. do this. Just pick up the desk. Tilt it around to aim and keep that thumb on the right thumbstick. And you shoot with the right trigger like normal. Go on, try it. Okay, I don't think I can do this. It's real easy. Just pick up the desk. Yeah, I can't How do this. How much hurt? But imagine. You gave it to yourself. Did you <laughs> Again, have imagine the having tools? the deck and just I bet not actually doing this. I'm thinking about it. You probably had to heat up a pin with the lighter or something. That sounds, I mean, that sounds... Awesome. Another tattoo idea I just had instead of a robot hand coming out holding a wrench, what if it was like a skeleton hand? You know, so you're looking at it like, what's he trying to say? Is he Fire. human on the inside or does he Shoot. have like a skeleton trapped in him? You know what? A skeleton arm tattoo. I decided that's the one I want. So when we get a free minute, I'll find a pen and we can eat up that light. Alright, everything checks out. <laughs> this thing is Perfect. I think we're good to go here. So, I was saving the best for last, but while you were in jail, I got us a meeting to show our turret to Cave Johnson. Oh, That's no. That's right, the owner of the company. No pressure, but if he likes this, he's going to make us rich forever. Are you ready? Let's go. Oh, dear. Yeah, okay, now they've created free energy, um, so that's great. We brought our desk with us. Uh, why are things on fire? What are you going to do with your share of the money? I know what I'm going to do is pay off the money I borrowed to make this turret. Like immediately pay it off. Or I'll, I mean, whew, I'll be in some real trouble. I do appreciate what they're doing. Plus this is big. I'll have to pay that. This would be a fantastic way to introduce <sighs> someone to Does like using to you that the, the big steam deck. More than what I borrowed in the first place. It doesn't seem like it, it's weird. Somebody overrode the control. This is the steam deck oh. game. Yes. Huh. 
That's one of the appliances I stole from housewares. Oh, geez, it's gotta... Somebody else was working on their own turret appliance at the same time. Hey, S5 Flare. This, I, I looked, I was looking for just like free games to play and fun games to play. And I realized I'd never played, and I mean, I didn't realize, I knew I'd never played Portal, but this said you don't need to know any of that. And the more we're playing it, the more I'm realizing that, yeah, this is just, this is a fantastic acclimation game for the Steam Deck. Um, it kind of took you through using all the controls and everything they could do. So it was fun. Uh, but yeah, somebody else made their own turret appliances. So we're in trouble. Gun! It's an ambush! Man, oh. he got that turret good, huh? Good thing I brought a couple spares. Yeah, up yours, pal. Oh, don't tell me I they're all it. turrets. It's the housewares department. How did they find out yep. about our turrets? They're all turrets. I can't believe it. They stole our idea, and now they're going to kill us with it. Housewares, man. They're never going to stop ambushing us. I mean, it's not really an ambush anymore. We know they're coming, but I don't think they're going to stop coming, though. We need to think of something else. Wait, so what does turn into a... Okay, so only right now the washing machines and ovens turn into things? Got it. I really da, da, think they're da, da, going to keep coming for, like, basically forever. I see you. Housewares, man. Can you believe it? Those guys are such pieces of... What did we ever even do to them? To the TVs? Oh, hell no. Oh, we're on all of the TVs. <laughs> okay. Nice work. I got the God, elevator working the again. But we have another 80 floors before we get to K. We're not going to survive 80 ambushes in a row. Your desk should have some buttons on the underside of it. Those fire the rockets that got built into the desk. They put those on there standard now for safety reasons. So, if you hit all... I don't know if we actually have these buttons, so I'm thinking because it's this, it will translate them to other buttons. But these look like the under buttons that they're talking about, so I'm not sure what they'll do in this case. Four buttons at once. It should rocket us up through all 80 levels real fast. Automatic deck launch sequencer engaged. Oh, okay, so I did Here these, we and it was go. fun. We are both launch. 10, 9, 8, 7. Modesty panel set to flight configuration. Modesty Three, panel. 2, 1. We have liftoff. Does that keep people from looking up my skirt when I'm flying through the air? I don't. Okay, really nice work. Good shooting. I think we're good from here. They probably gave up. I have given up by now. <sighs> okay, let's go show this thing to Cave. I don't also, think we're gonna get I do a promotion. Have one quick confession. Oh God. I didn't actually get an appointment with Cave Johnson. I lied about that. But it turns out. I didn't know this. It turns out nobody's seen him in years. I did know it when I lied to you about our appointment, but it was still pretty new information. Anyway, I'm not gonna lie to you anymore. <sighs> I think he might be a millionaire recluse now. So be ready for <laughs> not that. Not the jars. There might be a lot of jars. <laughs> okay, I like Hello, that. Mr. Johnson? <clears throat> Is that a, is that his head? Let's just go in. Mr. Johnson, are you here? Hey there. It's me, Cave Johnson. No, no, not behind the giant head. I am the giant head. I'm gonna level with you. A few years back, I got real sick. 
body riddled with disease. I was a goner. Threw every dollar I had at it. Told those eggheads, hey, eggheads, make me live forever. Now, I know what you're thinking. You gave the smartest engineers on Earth a blank check to make you immortal, and this is what they came up with? A giant head? Hey, Dre. <laughs> Off by a mile. No. They figured out how to put my consciousness in a computer. That's what's in the giant head. Their first plan was to put me in a regular brain-sized computer. Then they'd put that in a robot body and, hey, presto. Well, turns out you can't fit an entire human mind in a computer that small. All I could do was tell time and know what my name was. So they kept making it bigger. Big enough to cram every last bit of me into this thing. What happened to my robot body? Still under the head, somewhere all <laughs> crushed up. Couldn't support the weight. <laughs> so the lab boys put me in the big head, switched me on, and, uh, I don't know, I panicked. Killed a few of them. Said I'd kill more if they ever came back. Honestly, I, I regret that now. Anyway, that was four years ago. Been trying to get somebody's attention ever since. Get their butts up here and end my suffering. Now, don't worry about me. It's been a full life, but we're done here. I'm itching for the next step. Heck, I'm excited about it. Don't even think of it as killing me. You're breaking me out of prison. I'm just data now. I need you to crack this big clay head open so I can spill out into the universe. So, what do you two eggheads got? Uh, you, uh, you are in luck. We actually came up here to show you our new invention. Good stuff. Let's see it. Show them, partner. Well, I'm waiting. Look, I get it. It feels weird to shoot at the boss, but it's what he wants. You showing me something or what? All right, Easy fine. Do. Whoa, that'll work. I'll be honest, I thought you were two lunatics who dragged a toilet up here. Language. You are geniuses. Called us geniuses. Just doing a little rhinoplasty here, if you mind. A little down the side there, a little off the bridge. Oh, the cracks are okay. You know what? Uh, we let's need go to for find a... his weak spot. Son, this thing's made of clay. It's all weak spot. <laughs> Oh no! What? You are made of metal, sir. So shoot the metal. Is it working? I'm in the head. I can't see. It's working great, sir. It doesn't feel like it's working, but for the eggheads. I don't think it's working. But oh no! It's oh no! Happy. <laughs> it's ricocheting onto the office. Oh god! See that? I think that's his power source. Do y'all believe that this? What do you think? Up oh, here we go. Powering down. The great beyond. Boy, I'll, I'll give you two credit. That is one hell of an invention. You did it. You figured out how to end my suffering. All right. Suffering ended in three, two. <sighs> Backup power activated. <laughs> uh, you're both fired. I'm gonna need your key cards. Just lay them down in front of the head. Not too close to the chin or I won't be able to see you. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh, is he gonna... Is it... Is it happening? You know what? It just occurred to me. This is it. The only person who knows Cave Johnson asked us to kill him is... Now dead. Yup. Yeah. Do you know what the punishment for murder is? They told us in parole officer school, you're not gonna like this, uh, it's life. Your whole life in prison. We should, yeah, we, we, we should leave. 
Don't touch anything. And bring the desk. <laughs> Don't touch anything. And bring the desk. Oh no, the Mantis Society. Oh no. Months later. Months. Morning, Charlie. It's me, Gary. Gary, your boss. Keep inspecting those toilets. Good work, good stuff. Good. Hey, it's just me, Grady. Yeah, just like yesterday. Man, this witness protection yesterday. program is great. I don't know why we didn't turn state's evidence against those loan sharks in the first place. We don't have to pay any of the money back. We got cool new names. I like yours a lot, by the way. Oh, he's got his robot you know, arm tattoo. Or skeleton arm. You'd think they'd move us to another state or give us new jobs or something. Feels like everything is exactly the same, except our first names. Ah, you know what? They know what they're doing. Anyway, see you tomorrow, Charlie. <laughs> oh, with the mantis's free energy. Oh, with the mantis's free energy. Oh. Oh, they're singing. <laughs> oh wow <laughs> that is fantastic if you have a steam deck you should absolutely pop this on it's very fun I am curious how well this works on other um uh, Charlie, you're not O U R Urban B. That's me. That's me. That was me. It didn't have my name. That was fabulous. That was fabulous. That was amazing. Um, and yeah, I mean, I, I don't know um, if anybody like when they when they first first released. Pardon me. Um, when they first released this, if they basically said, "Hey, if you've got a Steam Deck, put this free game on because it's great." Um, but yeah, this is currently in the store. I'm just going to take the music off as I go out. Um, it's currently in the Steam store. It's optimized for Steam, for the Steam Deck, but you can play it, obviously, on PC. Um, that was really cute. 